Now right here is where they had fiber optics. They dug this hole out one time and then they came back and dug it out again. And uh, this is what fiber optics looks like. A switch panel, these little boxes up here that do whatever they do. And now you got this coming in. And that is what we believe to be 5G. Until I'm proven wrong, I'd love to know exactly what it is. But now, they've had this here for years. And it's underground, and you can, every so often, you can see another one of these boxes where they splice stuff together and do whatever they do. But to put it up in the air like that is new. And I believe it's not for good purposes, but they're going to say that it's really going to help us. But you do your research and you look into it, it don't. Well, there are fire departments right there. I'm going to ride over there and see how close I can get up inside it. Give you some pictures of it. All right. But no, they're not, they're not transmitters. They're just, they're just splices. You don't believe that's a transmitter type it's, thing? It's not a transmitter. It's just built for splices. And yeah, you sure. say that one up there is that Same thing. Well, uh, I, I can I can guarantee it. I've been in them. You've been in them. You know what it is. Okay. What about the silver ones? The ones that are silver. That's the ones that you. Like the silver ones that are mounted on the poles along the road. No, uh, they're up high, and instead of being black, they're silver. There's four or five of them right by Sonic, McDonald's, Hardee's. You ought to when you ride back around there. Well. I, I don't know exactly which ones you're talking about. I know if they look like that, that's a fiber splice. All they do is they bring that in, and they'll, they'll bring the bonds in, cut the sheets back, yeah. and they'll splice the fiber. When they run out of a, a coil, or if they think they might need to take it somewhere else, that's the same thing. So that's the reason they're putting all the wire around it in case they have to cut it? or Yes, that's it's spare in case they got to cut it or do something like that, or if they need to extend it. And also they put a splice like that in case they're going to run and take the fiber a different direction. Oh, that's the line. This way. Yeah, there's the line. You see that, that this bottom line. Yeah, it's a three-way splice. Yeah. But they put that in in case they need to go and do something else with it. That's all that is. Okay. Now that you charge that, you can find the line yeah. down through here. I, I do. I did put a transmitter on mine. That little box there is a transmitter. Okay. But I got to get after it. So. Go ahead. Go ahead. Appreciate it. Well, some people will educate you and talk to you and then they know what they know because they've been told what they've been told. I'm still fishing for the right answer. The fiber optics has always been here, AT&T, under the ground. This wire coming from over here to that tower is above ground. There's a difference in it. I think it's a setup for 5G. People. Hey, bike riders! Where y'all going? <laughs> Rogersville? Yeah. Where y'all going, Rogersville? <laughs> Break the echo chamber. Share this with someone who needs to hear it, or with someone you think might already get it. This video is Creative Commons. You have permission to download, copy, and distribute it by any means.